In addition to the predefined pages that we provide you on the Smart Site system, we have also added additional pages for you to add for any extra pages that you need and do not fall under any of those specific categories. So, to add additional pages, you simply go to the additional pages links on your website management portal and select the page you want to add or edit, and you can start with additional page 1. So, let's get started. You've got the option of adding header text which will be displayed over your actual header image, so just add a brief explanation about what that page is about. Next, select your header image, and this will always be compulsory to add. You can now add five keyword phrases as per the home page, but these are specific to this page only, so once you've added these keyword phrases, they will be added to the optimization of this page for search engines. You need to also add your page name, please keep this short and sweet, as it will also be your link on the top menu, so we have limited the page name to only a few characters. You now have the option of adding your page details. You have approximately 8,000 words that you can add, which is approximately 16 A4 single line pages. So, unless you want your readers to read a book from this one page, you should never run out of space. You are provided with the HTML editor once again, so inside the content of your actual page, you can add images, text, and even embed videos. You can align your images either left, centered, or right, and remember to do a spell check to tidy up your content. You can also make use of your H1 all the way through to H6 styles to enhance your page even more. And this is where the styling will take effect from our website styling form. Once you're done with adding your content, click on the Submit Page button and your additional page is automatically added to your site. These steps are duplicated on all the other additional pages, so you can add extra, customized pages to your site as needed. There is a separate form that allows you to either add or remove any of the additional pages that you have added, and it is called Publish slash Unpublish Pages. On this form, you can simply select which pages you want to be published and which pages you want to be removed, or use the option to remove all pages. If a page has been added, you will see next to each option, the name of the page will appear. If there is no page name, please ensure that you do not publish the page. As per all our forms, when you have made the changes, simply click on the Make Changes button at the bottom of the page.